Okay, let's go back and touch again on the follow through. You remember I said the follow through is when you stroke all the way through the cue ball. And as I mentioned before, if you're keeping everything locked in place, using the pendulum stroke as you come forward, your bridge hand, I mean your grip hand, is actually coming up, which as it comes up, it's pushing the cue down. So it would look like this. It comes up, tip goes down. Well, we want to use that kind of a stroke all the way through every shot, whether it be a stop shot we're making, a follow shot we're making, or a draw shot we're making, we always want to stroke through the cue ball. We'll do the kind of like this. Let's use a stop shot first, and we'll just go through the cue ball like that. We went through just about four inches, and we stopped the cue ball right there. We would use the same type of a follow through if we were using it on a follow stroke, like so. We went through the cue ball four to six inches, and we followed along behind it. Now we could do the same with a draw stroke where we're still going to go through the cue ball and we're going to make the cue ball come back to us. But it's always executed through the follow through. Follow through on a cue ball is very, very important.